Hey there, I got more parts, so let's go install. Oh hey, and thanks for noticing my patchy teenage beard. But come on, it's no shave November. And what excuse can be better than an entire month dedicated to lazy facial grooming? Alright, so today you may have guessed it. Yep, we're working on the WRX again. Woo! What a surprise! Way to change it up, Hayden! I know, but it doesn't matter. I'm getting parts in, that's what we're doing. Anyways, today we're doing a double din... thing. Anyways, today we're installing a double din stereo. And guess what? That's right, it won't break your bank. And if you're interested in it, of course, I'll have a link in the description. When do I never not have a link in the description? Just start looking. If I'm not even doing a video on a product, just... I talk too much and too fast. Thing. Anyways, so this thing's pretty cool actually. It's got hands-free, Bluetooth, FM radio. It's got a USB port to download music, photos, and movies. You can even plug in a rear view camera so you can see who exactly you're backing into. So what you should get in the package is of course your double din stereo. And a little package with your wiring harnesses, manual, and remote. Oh, hi there. Yeah, so now we're gonna be taking off all this, and I don't know, we'll just time lapse that, I guess. Done, so now this is off. It's pretty much just all like popping pins, and that's all good to go. And now I'll show you the rest of it. So now we're gonna take this screw and that screw out. I also forgot there's a screw down here and a screw down there. Don't forget to take those out, otherwise, that won't move and you'll be confused for about 20 minutes. I wanna unplug your harness. And now you can throw this pieces away. No, I was totally lying. You have to actually take this metal piece off. So you're gonna wanna keep these two pieces because these are actually gonna go on the new deck. There's the ugly monster and here's the nice sleek new uh, thing. I don't know what the description words are hard. So now we can just get rid of this hunk of junk. And then we take the plates, we took off the old one and we put it on the new one. All right, so now everything's done for the new deck. I actually had to drill new holes because uh, it wouldn't fit quite right. And I actually had to cut out a little bit on the sides, but now it fits all good and she's ready to go. Now we have to wire new wires to old wires, which is always a good time. So to be able to do that, we're gonna need the little manual that you got for your new deck. And you're gonna have to go online and print out a wiring diagram for your specific vehicle. So I have everything wired in now. I have the speaker harness and the control and power harness all wired in. Now we just have to put the stereo in. Looking good. I give you a brand new stereo. As you can see, we have multiple features. We have Bluetooth, auxiliary, we have the settings, movies, music, FM. You got a whole bunch of other stuff to play with. Even if you go into Bluetooth, you have your thing. You can even go to your music and play some of that. But I still if you click in this knob, you can adjust the bass, treble, balance, fade, loudness, you can even change the equalizer, and it even gives you the option to adjust the brightness, contrast, saturation, and hue of the screen. You can view your images, and if you click on the side, you can set them as your background. Now I have an amazing background. You click on movie, and you can see all the videos you have. If I click this one, it'll play. <laughs> You get the idea. If you want to set the time, just click on that big time old thingy McJigget, and there you go. You can set the time. What the hell? What's the date today? Uh, I'm not sure. 11 o'clock. And then click save. Well, ladies and gentlemen, that's all I have for you. I hope you enjoyed the video, and thanks for watching. Yep, you're right. I forgot to film the outro, so I'm doing it while I edit, which I actually have to get back to. So I'll see you later. And if there's ever an excuse, be. And if there's ever, let me try this all over again. And what excuse is better than an entire month dedicated to facey, 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 brazen? An entire month dedicated to never shaving your face. That was funny. I'm funny man. Yes.